Now, this is what we needed from the start of the series. Some good setup with some villains, and we're getting some progression right now, I've got to say. But never mind all that. We all know that who's got the best waifu right now out there, everyone. And I'm calling it before any of you guys can say it. Like, Tamaki Kotatsu, she's my girl. All the others can go fuck themselves, I'm just saying. <laughs> So from the start of this chapter, we get to see the beginning of the firefighter tournament that we got for all the newcomers, and we got to see a bunch of the new competition that we're going to be dealing with. One of them being, which one of my favorites is Tamaki, which she seems to have an incident where she seems to get people to jump on her and grab her tears, mainly with our set main character Shinra. Went up all up in that chest, even grabbing that ass, and I'm like, holy shit, like that's... Yeah, that's one way to appeal to a certain audience there, just completely grabbing that bitch and finding out that she's actually per part of the first brigade. That's kind of interesting to see. And like, you know, we got a bunch of like big deals in there, you know, we got the like the priest and all that with like the soul temple. We see like this present guy. There is one suspicious looking motherfucker in there, like just hiding just up on there. So I'm very curious who exactly he is with that with like all the fraud and everything. And even seeing, you know, the number one brigade as well there, which is this, like, cool-ass man, which, from what we saw, this is the guy that we saw, like, from, like, the start of the chapter. This was actually one of the guys that was, like, in his backstory that we saw, so I'm very curious exactly since he knows about that incident and he was there, but it obviously seems like he's keeping stuff away from him, and he's like, yeah, I'm reporting, I'm Shinra, can you please tell me about this incident? And he's like, boy, I've been doing this for 12 years. Honestly, do you think I can do that? And I just love this, like, like yo, Tamaki, put your fucking pants, like, put your fucking badge in your pants and all that. We ain't got time for this. Like, jumping on everyone and just, like, you know, every, even after got a bit of that booze. And it's just, like, honestly, at the end, Shinra just grabbing that. He was just grabbing that ass like it was nothing. And I'm like, that's something to fucking do. And it's like, that's, you know, that's something very cool. And I'm very curious to see what exactly that's going to be. But it's like, Honestly, yeah, that was very something of a surprise, I guess, from the entirety of Fire the Gate, honestly. And see that, you know, the, the whole exam was going to be, uh, begin, and we get to see people, like, honestly, we got to see, like, like, Tamaki, like, she had, like, this sort of cat technique. She was able to, like, form, like, you know, ears and tails and stuff, and, like, claws. And I was like, you know, she has an interesting ability for, like, being a second-generation person. And I was, like, very curious to see what exactly that was going to be. And, like, and we see that that main guy from last, you know, we chatted and all that, you know, that motherfucker Joker. I'm very curious. And it's like, he's definitely, like, you know, he's obviously got the whole card thing going down. I mean, sure, I'm making spades, hearts, diamonds, clubs, and all that. And he's like, oh, by the way, all those people that you're supposed to be able to deal with, they're, like, the examiners and all that, I've taken care of them. Now... Let's talk about what happened 12 years ago that befell your family. I'm guessing you have a few questions about that since my situation. So I'm kind of curious how much we're going to actually learn about this. And I'm curious just to honestly how, how much we progress throughout this. And, you know, this is honestly one of the chances I've been wanting to see for a while. Like, maybe if we actually had this last week, some of this stuff going to, I think I'd be building up a lot more interest. But this, honestly, right now, this should be maybe where, like, the first volume or something should end or something like that. It's like... Definitely bring some interest into the series, and hopefully, you know, it just improves from this later on. Honestly, I'm going to give this one a solid 7.5 out of 10. I really enjoyed it, but let me know in the comments down below. I'm just saying to Maki, she's my girl. So far, I liked it. Everyone else so far, like, they haven't really introduced themselves, and honestly, they all look a bit weird. And that guy from the first grade, he looks like a fucking badass altogether. I'm really digging the eye patch and just the look all together. But let me know in the comments down below. But that's all from me, all from me, and I will catch you guys next time.